The Hopkinton Diversity and Cultural Alliance hosted a community letter and postcard writing event. Participants wrote letters to American soldiers and Muslim neighbors. The Diversity and Cultural Alliance was founded in November 2016 by Hopkinton resident Tamoria Saba. I'm Tamoria Saba. I'm the founder of Hopkinton Diversity and Cultural Alliance. And what we are is a group of residents and parents. And our mission is really just to connect people in the community interested in discussing issues of diversity, all types of diversity, uh, openly in a safe and supportive environment and also fostering uh, connections with each other. Today what we're doing is we're hosting a letter and postcard writing event. We're writing to American soldiers stationed abroad. We're also writing to um, our Muslim neighbors. You know, right now we know that everyone's feeling a little bit of tension, a little bit of fear. So we just want to have people channel whatever they're feeling into doing something positive. And we felt that writing their feelings out on paper and actually being able to give those to people, like our soldiers and our neighbors who deserve it, just giving them that would just help everybody feel comfortable I uh, feel like they're contributing something positive and lessen the tension a little bit. Many of the attendees made nice pictures and paintings. We decorated various cards that we'd be able to send. Um, some of them are for service people and others are for our Muslim neighbors. Hi, Hi Dad! <laughs> what are your names? You guys write some letters today? Or? Yeah. yeah. We're making letters. <laughs> Valentine's Day. Hi, Dad. <laughs> what did you write in your letter? We wrote people who are in the army and soldiers and, and neighbors and other people in Hopkinton. A couple members of the Hopkinton Diversity and Cultural Alliance shared why they got involved. <laughs> coordinated with Tamoria um, just to put together this event to support our Muslim neighbors and soldiers um, overseas working for our country um, just to write letters of support um, during this kind of tumultuous time um, and just to let them know you know everyone's welcome here in Hopkinton um, we welcome everyone of all backgrounds and, um, and for the you know appreciate what they contribute to our community yeah we're here for you, no matter what the situation is, everywhere else. We value your contribution to our community. A couple of attendees we talked to mentioned that the event was a good time and educational. It's educational for the kids to learn that they should send greetings to make people feel appreciated in the community. Fun to get involved with the community, meet other families in town of different cultures, and also do something nice for our community. Awesome. I think we had probably 40 people around, 30 to 40. Yeah, yeah it was over. great. And kids, it was awesome that the kids came. Yeah, we were excited for the turnout, and the kids yeah. got to do their stickers and stamps. And, yeah, um, it was fun. <laughs> As you can hear. <laughs> <laughs> Tamoria shared with us some background information about the event. So um, I founded Hopkinton Diversity and Cultural Alliance in November, uh, shortly before the election. And we started out, we had about 50 members right away. And then after the election, it shot up to over 200. Um, and I think what's really special about our group is that it's not political. You know, and everybody's viewpoints are respected. We have a lot of open dialogue, everything from issues of socioeconomic diversity to racial diversity to diversity in ability, sexual orientation, age. So it's when you hear the words diversity, sometimes you think everything's going to be racial, that you're going to have conversations solely about black and white. But this is about celebrating and also discussing openly difficult topics of diversity across all sorts of issues. So it's been a really, really positive experience and the community has responded really well and I'm so appreciative of everyone's support. Um, this event we're doing today, the letter writing is the first time we've done it and we'll probably do many more.